After graduating high school, I was not planning on running cross country in college, and I can't remember exactly when I changed my mind, but I'm so grateful that I did. Joining cross country made the transition from high school to college much smoother, and I found a lot of friends right away. After my freshman year of running with the cross country team, I knew that I would keep running for the rest of my college career for the next three years. I love the relationships that I've formed and just being mentored by wonderful coaches. Balancing athletics and academics is not easy by any means. It has taken a lot of discipline and intentionality and hard work. And throughout my time as a student, I've taken on obviously athletics and academics, but also internships and volunteering and other extracurricular activities. And I've realized that if I care about something enough, then I will make it work with my schedule. But it does require a lot of discipline and learning how to say no and learning how to prioritize. As a senior on the cross country team, I served as one of our captains. But whether or not you are a captain of the team, everyone contributes as a leader. Uh, we learn how to work together, and even though cross country is a very individual sport, um, we're racing for our own times, trying to set personal records, and um, putting a lot of training in for ourselves. We're also working together to um, score points and win as a team. And so even though some of it is more individual, you learn how to work together, work with one another, and serve as a leader. Um, it's really all about attitude and respect and encouraging one another every day in practice and in races. One thing I've realized is that even though I've won races and won awards, it's really not about those big moments in the end. It's really exciting to win, but that excitement will not sustain and will not last, and any success won't sustain you for a long time. So when I look back and think about my greatest memories, it's not about the big things, but it's more about the everyday, waking up at 5 a.m. with your teammates, and um, just being together, and the small victories of every day. I really loved working with my coaches, Trey Meadows and Bree Williamson. They really influenced me a lot and taught me so much. And I also met my fiance on the cross country team, so that was certainly exciting. One of my greatest memories from my last season as a cross country runner was our trip to nationals. We went to New York and decided to stop at Niagara Falls before going to our hotel. And it was horrible weather, it was freezing cold, rainy, and windy. And we stayed only for about 10 or 15 minutes, but it was so much fun, we were laughing the whole time, and it was very worthwhile, and I won't forget that day. After I graduate, I plan to start interpreting. I'm an American Sign Language interpreting major, and so I plan to stay in the Twin Cities and start working as an interpreter. I am hoping to get my master's degree within the next five years, and although this is an ambitious goal, um, I'm hoping to do some research. The interpreting field is pretty wide open in some ways as far as research, and so I'm hoping to um, kind of pioneer my way through the untouched areas of the field.